Hello, everyone, and thanks for joining us for this news update. I'm Sue Levitt. Well, kids at Doolittle Community Center now have brand new flag football uniforms and flags thanks to a generous donation from the Las Vegas Raiders. Doolittle Community Center has been running the Westside Schools Flag Football League for many years. The league is free and caters to low-income participants and inner-city kids. Once the Raiders heard about Doolittle's football program, they jumped in to help with the donation. The uniforms came in a commemorative inaugural season 2020 Raiders box. Well, Nevada's higher education system has approved a policy requiring COVID-19 vaccination for employees. Employees must provide proof of COVID-19 vaccination on or before December 1st. New NSHE employees must be vaccinated before they start on the job. Failure of an employee to comply with the mandate will result in termination from employment. Medical and religious exemptions will be considered. As the flu season approaches, health officials are encouraging flu shots. According to the Nevada Department of Health and Human Services, flu rates for the 2020-21 season were kept low due to the precautions taken to avoid the spread of COVID-19. Health officials say that flu vaccines are the best way to get protection against influenza. They also encourage Nevadans to resume the precautions that were used last season to prevent the spread of the flu in Nevada. For more information, you can visit immunizenevada.org. Wildlife fire officials have lessened seasonal fire restrictions on public lands in southern Nevada by lifting stage one fire restrictions. The restrictions include building, maintaining, attending or using a fire campfire, charcoal barbecue or stove fire, smoking except within an enclosed vehicle, and welding or operating a torch with open flames except by permit. Year-round fire restrictions will continue. Well, October 3rd through the 9th is Fire Prevention week, which is a great time to bring you a few fire safety reminders. Smoke alarms can save lives and should be fully functioning in your home. You need one alarm on every level of your house, in each bedroom and in the hallways. You should test your smoke alarms once a month and replace the batteries every six months. Smoke alarms should be replaced every 10 years. And if you don't have working smoke alarms in your home or cannot afford them, Las Vegas Fire and Rescue will install them for free. To get information, you you can call 702-229-0366. Well, that's going to do it for this City News Update. Thanks for joining us. Have a great day, and we'll see you next time.